Out of the $73 million Norfolk school budget, $5 million is being spent on transporting students. Although the city's school system has witnessed a declining enrollment over the last 10 years, increasing gasoline prices are sending up busing costs annually. To make sure that doesn't happen next year, the school board has appointed a committee to find ways to reduce transportation expenses. Among the ideas being considered by the five-member panel is a change in student attendance zones, which has been adopted in Shreveport, Louisiana, Nashville, Tennessee. Several committee members visited the cities last week. What they found was that the Shreveport experience is uh, not very similar to Norfolk's at all. In Nashville, it was. The new plan was stayed by the Sixth Circuit Court of Appeals uh, just prior to the opening of school this year and they are in fact operating under their desegregation plan under which they have operated for the past 10 years. But Ray says through such site visits, meetings, legal consultations and public hearings, the committee wants to ensure that Norfolk schools remain desegregated. The ad hoc committee hopes to have its transportation report complete and ready to submit to the school board in May. The committee can opt to keep the current busing plan or make revisions. If any changes are made, school administrators say the new plan would become effective next September. In Norfolk, Ava Hurdle, The Daily News.